One in every eight women will be affected by breast cancer, so Fox 19 is teaming up with Susan G. Komen for the cure to give women better odds for survival. Every month, we'll shine a spotlight on survivors and the efforts to find a cure for breast cancer. It's hard to find anyone who hasn't been touched in some way by cancer. Trisha Mackey lost her sister Beth to cancer in 2005. To watch the slow demise of a loved one and all of the meanness that cancer represents and just, uh, just to watch everything that she went through, it was just so hard. It was so hard on all of us. Tracy Johnson watched cancer take its toll on her girlfriend, Becky. I spent two years um, just, you know, making the journey through breast cancer, you know, going to the treatments and getting to know her family and getting to know her girls, not knowing what the outcome would be. Becky survived breast cancer. Um, my grandmother had it actually on my dad's side. It was one that was kind of scary to, to hear and, and kind of go through her process. Katie Morgan's grandmother Dottie caught the cancer early and beat it. So did my mother Pat. Finding out my mother had breast cancer was one of the scariest moments of my life. I was 17, a senior in high school, but I'm happy to tell you she survived and now she's a very healthy grandma. My mom, Tracy's friend, and Katie's grandma are among the more than 2.2 million breast cancer survivors in America. They're examples of why it's so important to take steps to prevent the disease. Kimberly Holmes says that doesn't always happen in the African-American community. An African-American woman starting at 20 years old is twice as likely to die of breast cancer. Twice as likely. And the problem is African-American women are getting screened at older ages. So the women of Fox 19 are teaming up to get the message out about breast cancer prevention, raise awareness about the fight against breast cancer, and raise funds for Susan G. Komen for the cure. Getting the message out there, definitely helping with funds. By doing that, get exams, you know, their yearly exams. And um, I think it's true that when you're, if, if you're not okay, your family's not okay and your home's not okay. So many times as a woman, you put the kids first, you put your husband first, but this time you need to put you first. Well, I just hope that one day that we can find a cure for this deadly disease. And we would love for you to get involved. You can find out more at our website, fox19.com.